Hello and welcome to another Prop Dog review. Today it's just me, Alex, on my Todd, because Jason is off uh, enjoying a colonoscopy I got him for his birthday. So I uh, hope you are, Jason, and I uh, hope you're all cleaned out nicely. So what I'm going to talk about today is Upper Hand by Gary Jones. Now I absolutely love this, so this is my chance while Jason is away to rave about someone that I, I really rate in the magic world, and that is Gary. He is a worker um, from the southwest of England, and, and this is one of those tricks that's very, very easy to do, and yet it looks like you've got amazing sleight of hand. It is basically the old classic cards to pocket routine, which if you know, signed cards to pocket even. And uh, what you get is basically you get these, um, these four jokers here, uh, they sort of come with it, and you can have these in your pocket at any time, you can then pull out, you can, you, can, you can be using this deck, there's nothing special about these cards at all. Uh, you can ask them, you can even get the spectators to choose four card, a card each, or one spectator can choose a, a four cards, so they could just say the four aces. These can then be signed, okay, and that is really, really important. Um, and then, yeah, and then you then, you then just sort of give them the jokers, uh, so you give them their signed cards, you get them to put them in their hands, you put the jokers in your pockets and uh, you click your fingers and you produce their signed selections from your pockets and they're then holding the jokers. It is a remarkable transformation, it's really easy to do. If you can buckle the bottom card um, of a packet of uh, four um, or five even, then um, you can do this trick. Um, and of course if you've got some pockets, you can even put the jokers into uh, other people's pockets if you like. Um, Gary uses his top pocket um, because he's wearing a jacket. If you're not wearing a jacket you can even just stick it in your back pocket, um, something like that. It's incredibly versatile and, and really all, you, all you've got to carry around is, is, is the gimmicks, the, the four uh, the jokers that um, come with the pack and you can put them in, you can just add it into any routine. You can add it in obviously brazenly because you're saying, no, I've got four jokers here and then do the switch. So. Um, works with um, any cards. Gary actually goes into details uh, of how to remake the gimmick, should you want to use, I suppose, different backed cards, or, or even if yours has just got a little bit old and battered from overuse, and I'm sure you will be using it. Um, so it's really well taught. Um, Chris Congreve should also get a mention because he helped Gary with this routine. I'm not sure how much of a contribution, um, but um, I'm sure he helped a lot, and um, I know they're close friends. So, so there you go, and really, really, um, Brilliant trick, very easy to do, really well taught by Gary, lots of live performances of it being done, um, and incredibly versatile. So really, I mean, I can't remember how much it is, but um, you get all the instructions, online instructions, um, and I think you'll, you'll just be up and running and really enjoying playing with Upper Hand. I highly recommend it. Um, I carry it everywhere. I've performed it at uh, the Magic Circle for the Rally Bongo Day. Um, I actually did it in a transparent jacket that I got from Dominic Duvier. Um, so it's wonderful. So there you go. So um, yes, well done Gary, well done Chris, and uh, I hope you guys out there have, give it a good look and um, bye.